Hello everyone, I am Shamant Gowda, CSAT faculty at Insights IAS. I welcome you once again for the CSAT series question of the day. This is yesterday's bouncer question. This was a previous year question also, okay. 15 into 14 into 13, okay, up to 1, where you have to find the 3 power m into n, okay. You have to write this in the form of 3 power m into n, where m and n are positive integers. Then what is the maximum value of m? You have to focus only on the m, okay. m where is the power of 3? Means yesterday also in the few questions I have explained that how to take the maximum power of any prime factor, okay. Now, in this 15, do we have 3? Yes. How many 3s? 1, 3. Okay. 14, we do not have. 13, we do not have. 12 also, we have a 3 here, right? Okay. Similarly, in the 11, we do not have. In the 10 also, we do not have 3. In a 9, we have 2 3s. Okay. Similarly, 8, we do not have. 7, we do not have. In the 6, we have a 3. In the 5, we do not have. In the 4, we do not have. In the 3, we have a 3 here. That is it. So, how many 3s are there? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So, maximum power of 3 is 6, where that 6 is given as m here. So, the value of m is 6. This is the question of the day. This was asked in a 2023 paper itself. A, B, C, D is a square, one point each of A, B and C, D. Okay, see, A, B, C, D is a square. Let us draw a square here now. Let us name the coordinates A, B, C and D. These are the vertex and two distinct points on each of BC and DA, see, one point on each of AB and CD, see AB, one point is there and CD, one point is there and two distinct different points on each of B, C and DA, see, BC two points, DA two points, okay, this is how the points are there, totally one, two, three, four, five, six points are there. How many distinct triangles can be drawn? Distincts again different triangles can be drawn using any three points as vertices out of these six points. See, vertex means wherever two line joins, a point is created. That point is called vertex, okay. Two or more line joins, also a point is created, vertex. Two or more lines joining intersection point is called vertex, okay. Now, this is what the vertex here. If I make a triangle like this, see, I can make one triangle like this. I can make a triangle like this also. So, whenever I am drawing a triangle, I am using 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 3 vertex. So, each and every time we are making use of 3 vertex here, okay. This is the point. This is the point where two line joins that becomes a vertex. So, in our options, I will be having how many choices as my vertex here, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Out of 6, I am choosing every time 3. This is a combination question, okay. Out of 6, every time I am choosing 3. So, how many different 3's I can be chosen? 6 C 3, which can be written as 6 into 5 into 4 divided by 3 into 2 into 1, okay. Start from 6, right, 3 terms here, 6 into 5 into 4, 3, 6 into 5 into 4, whole divided by 3 factorial, which is nothing but 3 into 2 into 1. This is what combination. Or else, n, c, r, where n is the number of choices, where r is the rate at which we are choosing, which is given in the formula n factorial by n minus r factorial into r factorial, where n factorial is 6 factorial, whole divided by 6 minus 3, which is 3 factorial into 3 factorial, which can be written in the short form as. 6 into 5 into 4 by 3 into 2 into 1. So, 6, 6 cancels, 5 into 4 is 20 triangles can be drawn. A direct question which can be solved in less than 15 seconds. This is a very similar question in the same line as I explained. How many diagonals can be drawn using the vertices of an hexagon? Solve this question and put the answer in the comment section. Thank you. We will see you in the next video. Hello guys. On 21st of July, a CSAT course was supposed to be launched. But because of lot of requests from the students across, we have decided to postpone the starting date of the class for a week. Rather than 21st of July, we are starting it from 28th of July. And also the early bird offer which was till 10th of July is also extended till 20th of July. 
so those of you guys who are still planning to to get the admission to this course so you have an opportunity till 20th of july you'll be having the early bird discount of 15% so make yourself get admitted to this course and start the preparation of csat as early as possible and do not let the csat spoil your chances to become a civil servant thank you